I wanna be supported by you, my sugar daddy poo 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 poo. I don't want to kiss by you because it's full 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 full. Woohoo! I come your sugar daddy. You look like a sexy sugar baby to me. I will shower you with all my golden riches for your love and affections. But I'm gonna need a kissy. Kissy, kissy. Okay. <laughs> hey guys, how you doing? A little bit different format, this video. We thought we would start with some funny improv videos like this one about seeking arrangements is what is commonly known as the business around the world. Um, you guys might be wondering, how prevalent is seeking arrangements in Ukraine? Sugar daddy, sugar baby. And why don't you tell the story, honey? You know, that's yesterday. Oh, we just uh, met one guy, yeah, in the restaurant, and he told that he's in a relationship, he had a girlfriend, so I was very curious <laughs> what kind of like relationship they had, because he didn't call her soulmate or like life partner or something like this, just exactly girlfriend, so I was thinking, you know, Go yeah, I go to the toilet, I come back, and uh, he's showing her uh, and all the photos of him and her and, and yeah. everything. She's a very social butterfly. <laughs> yeah, I was surprised, you know, because of age gap they have, but... Uh... So let's talk about the age gap. He's 71, she's yeah. about your age, right? Yeah, about my age. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, so what do you think of that? Uh, they were, they've been together uh, basically on and off for 10 years, so mm. he said. No, they in a relationship like for two years, but he known her for ten years. Okay. Like this. What she said. Uh, he he's very realistic, you know, about his expectations. He's not going to marry her, you know. So it's just kind of a union of two people who to satisfy their needs, you know. Um, very honest, without like sincere relationship or real feelings, you know. Like maybe there is kind of, but I mean feelings, but maybe like. Friends or something like this. Friends, Friends with benefits. benefits. Yes, something like this. So, baby, what do you think about this? The seeking arrangement, sugar daddy, sugar baby situation, business around the world? Mm, I think it's uh, kind of become very popular in the world, unfortunately. It's uh, opposite of, uh, you know, family. Okay, if America has 10% uh, seeking arrangements, sugar babies types, what percentage would it be in Ukraine? What's your guess, honey? Mm, I, I have a hard time to guess, but maybe 30. I don't know. Maybe 30? Too high. But I think 30, definitely 30%? more. 30%? Yeah, mm -hmm. That was my number. Uh -huh. And we didn't discuss this, so yeah, uh, we continue to be on the same wavelength. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And why is that? Simply because of the depressed you know, economic situation in Ukraine, right? Bottom. Mm -hmm. Uh, young girls in difficult financial situation. And also they're beautiful. So they, you know, they offer it to have this kind of position. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they're looking for it. And of course, there's lots of um, sugar daddies looking for sugar babes. And this business has just been exploding around the world. Uh, and it is very prevalent in Ukraine. Uh, so what to say about this? Um, okay, let's talk personal. We'll come back to the business of uh, Sugar Daddy, Sugar Baby in a moment. So, honey, I'm just going to ask you, you, before we talked about this, you've never felt like when we've been out and about walking mm -hmm. around that people were looking at us and judging us in that sort of regard or age gap. But you did this trip to Odessa. What, what happened? What, what changed, do you think? And how did you feel? Uh, the change maybe because I wear my glasses so I can see people's faces <laughs> and read something from this because normally I don't care about what people think but uh, because of uh, Odessa like known for this kind of, of relationship and uh, like many foreigners they are really it's friend it's uh, like friendly uh, for tourists and uh, I mean it's this this perception uh, from people caused because this exists in Ukraine exists a lot like I don't judge, judge you know like saleswoman who talk to me like in Russian you know why you care about how much this bag cost because he will buy it from for you you know like <laughs> buy expensive one and say it's my husband you know and she like wait she feel like she 
tell something wrong, you know. You're talking so, about when we went shopping. Yeah, when for shopping. me, <laughs> for me. <laughs> no, it yeah. was for me. I chose bag. Remember, and she, ah, the she bag. was telling me ah. to choose in Russian, like mm-hmm. choose the most expensive. Mm-hmm. You will not pay for it. Why you care? You know. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I said to my husband, and she was like, "Oh, oops." <laughs> and this is this is prevalent in Odessa shops, especially in Odessa, but all over Ukraine. Yeah. yeah. So, so so how did did you feel like um people were judging us and how did it make you feel? It doesn't feel make me feel very happy. <laughs> Even I asked Joseph what will be in Canada. <laughs> what how it will be there because here I feel uh it's uh, even not um, prejudice, yeah? Prejudice, this word. Mm-hmm, prejudice, yeah. yeah. You feel it's not prejudice? It's not prejudice about age gap, but it's prejudice about I'm scamming you, you know? Scamming you. And I'm not <laughs> happy about this, you know? Because I know what we have and I really appreciate this, you know? I love loving family. And then, like, you know, I look in front of people who don't know me and they perceive this, uh, like, local situation that, you know, like, Okay, next guy, poor guy, who I'm scamming. <laughs> I see. So that's what bothers you more, not not uh, the um, perception of age gap, but the perception of you're scamming me. Mm-hmm. Interesting. Um, I I just want to rewind a second and say, you know, Anya actually has a bigger uh, prescription than myself. So she's about a two point minus two point seven five. No, minus two point two five. I'm minus one and a half. So. Okay, um, the next video will be about my bikini size or what? <laughs> no, I'll just say she never wears glasses, but she wore glasses this time, and hence now you know she sees all these people or some people judging us, right? So I was wondering, honey, why you never noticed that before? Not that I notice it because I don't look for it, but I know that it exists when you're, you know, any couple with a twenty-year age gap like, like us. Um, but I have a question for you: Is that uh, could? When I met you, okay, you didn't have glasses on. Is that how come you fell for me or what? <laughs> didn't have glasses no, I on? Can, I can you see can you see. clearly when I close. I cannot see far away, but no. Come on. <laughs> okay, okay. All right. So what else do we want to say? Again, total improv video. I guess I want to add that when you're dating in Ukraine, you just need to be aware that you know, this business exists. And if you're dating young, beautiful ladies, uh, the chances are, I'm going to say one in three, um, she's been a sugar baby before. Uh, and I have talked to a few other in- industry people about this. And although it's a wag, it's a wild ass get, wild ass guess number. Uh, it's a significant amount. So um, this is one of the challenges with onboarding young, beautiful ladies in anyone's database. And we screen them very, very carefully uh, because we don't want, you know, past sugar babies in uh, the database. But yeah, it's a prevalent situation here. And I guess the other thing we want to just tell guys out there is if, if you're looking for sugar daddy, sugar baby situation, it's prevalent in Ukraine. You don't need an agency. You can just come and, you know, try your luck, but you can, you can find that. There's ample of that in Ukraine. I can say even more. If okay. you want sugar baby situation and you come to our agency, our most database, no, most, our main database of the ladies, they will reject you because they not normally open to relationship with more than 15 years old age, age gap. So basically yes, true. you will be turned down. And we have many, 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 countless examples of that too, of guys that do our complimentary introductory package, meet 10 ladies, have a Skype call with one lady free. And so they <clears throat> put it out there, they invite 10 ladies out and we've had them get, get goose egg back, zero, when they're 20, 25 years or more uh, age gap. You know, uh, they're inviting out young hotties. So it, it's just a, it's a litmus test of our database as well to us internally. But yeah, if you're looking for sugar baby situation, don't come to Mass Guarantee. We cannot help you. <laughs> but uh, just hit the streets and, you know, you have find it. what you want, you know? <laughs> yeah, th- there's a lot of it in Ukraine. Next video that we're going to do live, I, I'm not sure if I'm going to join Anya, but Anya has decided, uh, I've kind of talked her into doing a video that um, she's calling the seven keys 
to successfully pulling off a large age gap relationship in Ukraine. No, it's not connected to large age gap, I can tell you. Okay, let me put it this way. How many of these seven keys do you and I have in our marriage, our relationship? I think uh, we have all, all people have all, but it depends on how strong connection on each level, okay. on each of seven levels. How many of these seven levels or seven keys do we have a strong connection with in our relationship? We have uh, more, most of them on strong, very strong levels. So what's that? Six? Six, yes. I did six. six. <laughs> so, and we have a large age gap. So my point is that whether you have a large age gap or don't have a large age gap, it, it doesn't matter. But I'm just adding the point, honey, that if a guy doesn't look for large age gap, but he just looks for connection on these seven levels, he can have a true love, large age gap relationship is my point. Yeah, but I know guys, you know, you want uh, age gap not because you're looking for, you know, deep... Uh, love you know you're looking for big books you know and it's different you know <laughs> that's what i'm very against I young big again, boobs normally <laughs> <laughs> and, and does that piss you off or what no everybody free to you know to like to want what they have but they need to understand what they really you know looking for like you, you have friend you know who who uh who who date, uh, you know, like very young lady with like big age gap, and he has no, he, he don't want to marry, for example, you know, don't want, but uh, he 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 feels okay that she is uh, shame with him to appear in the same city where they live, so they just travel together, you know, when where nobody knows her, no her. If this kind of uh, feelings, you know, okay for you, then you know it's not what we talk about, you know. I mean, <laughs> on my topic. My topic is about, you know, okay, we can call it dream, dream relationship or dream couple or like real soulmate for you, you know, how, how to find out how to program her in your life that she will appear, you know, basically on which level of connection you want and what, you know, okay. <laughs> yeah. Dream partner. Can I call like this? Yes. So how to find seven, uh, seven keys to finding your dream partner. Dream partner. Yes. It's basically dream partner. It's not connected to. That's what she wants to say. Yeah. See, she's a better title writer than me. Seven keys to finding your dream partner with yeah. a large age gap. That's yours. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's what guys want. You're right. It's maybe. Okay. So I'm just encouraging guys that, Hey, you know, I'm in a, an, in a men's group forum and one guy launched a joke about, hey, listen, if you want a 20 year age gap, you gotta have uh, $2 million. If you want a, a, a 30 year age gap, you gotta have it, it, be a decamillionaire. If you want a 40 year age gap, you gotta be a billionaire, you know, kind of thing. Mm -hmm. And I commented back, hey guys, there's a way to transcend the money equation with true love, okay? There is a way that you can find true love regardless of age gap and have it withstand the test of time as well. Mm -hmm. Yeah, And that's what Anne is talking about. So you're going to call it um, seven keys to finding your dream relationship and marriage. Yeah. Yeah. Perfect. So stay tuned for that, guys. I think Anne will probably be solo live on that one. So you can ask her all your questions. So guys, you definitely don't want to miss out on this upcoming incredible video. So make sure you click on the subscribe button below this video. And smash the bell so YouTube will notify you when we go live. And yeah, if you could like, that would be awesome. And you're awesome. And you're awesome. And you're fantastic. Fantastic, guys. You're fantastic. See you next time, guys. Have you been searching for a beautiful wife? Do you dream of meeting the perfect woman, but haven't found her? Well, imagine if there was a simple way this could all change for you. Imagine if there was a Canadian marriage agency that would introduce you to as many beautiful women as it takes until you find the one. Ukraine, a lost world of beautiful traditional women. At last, 
A place where you can find the beautiful wife you have always dreamed of. Every Ukrainian woman dreams of having a happy family. Now you can have a traditional beautiful wife from Ukraine, creating happy family memories forever. So what are you waiting for? Register right now and Skype our beautiful ladies completely free. So what makes us different, you might ask? Why not ask Google simply by searching Match Guarantee Reviews.